We're getting some insight now into how well New Brunswick's free tuition program is working. When it was announced back in the spring, it was estimated about 7,100 students would benefit from it. CTV's Laura Brown has been checking into how many actually have benefited. I do have mixed feelings about it. Student Marie Mead says she applied for the free tuition access bursary but didn't qualify for it. Her parents' income was over the $60,000 cutoff. To, to an extent, it feels like they're doing this to be able to say that they're giving free tuition to people who can't afford it. The free tuition announced in the spring has undergone some criticism similar to Meads, but the Minister of Post-Secondary Education says it's working and he has numbers to back it up. We have over, you know, 13,000 people who apply for student financial services and, uh, you know, so far uh, what we've seen, uh, we've processed half of, of those applications and about 35% of those are eligible for the tuition access bursary program. So. That's about 2,000 students that Arsenault says will be getting the bursary and there will likely be more once they process the latter half. The provincial government set aside $25 million for this program, but Arsenault says if they happen to go over that, that's a good thing. He says they'll find the money because they'd rather students be staying in the province for their education. We'll just continue to make sure that as many people can benefit from it. So I'm not worried about um, if, if it does bust that budget or not. He also said improvements will be made as the program goes on, likely too late for Marissa Brown. Right now I'm in my fifth year of university, so at this point student loans are starting to rack up. So I, to me it's like at this point it would benefit me majorly if I could get it. She says she wishes it didn't depend on your parents' income. The UMB Student Union says they have been hearing that some students are confused about how to apply, but overall they're pleased with how it's been going. So Steve, you can hear there some mixed reactions still when it comes to this bursary program. Now I did speak to Arsenault about some of these concerns and he said he's hoping to improve the program as it goes on and he's going to be consulting with various groups and organizations this fall to see what could be improved. Steve. All right, Laura, thanks very much. CTV's Laura Brown for us tonight in Fredericton.